for the future, we hope to do many more projects like this in the villages. And also in the future, we would like to go and do projects. Namaskar, friends. Today we are going to meet you with a Mahila. जिनका जन्म तो पंजाब में हुआ है लेकिन इनकी पढ़ाई लिखाई सब इंग्लैंड में हुई है जिनका नाम है अंजलि पॉल और ये एक लीव एंड लर्न फाउंडेशन नाम का एनजीओ चलाती हैं इसमें अभी 33 बच्चे हैं जिनकी देखभाल के लिए चार लोग रहते हैं ये 33 वो बच्चे हैं जो कहीं रोड पर रह रहे थे कुछ अनाथ भी हैं इसमें ये अपने एन के माध्यम से इन बच्चों को एक सुखद जिंदगी देने का प्रयास कर रही हैं इन्होंने आ, कुछ किताबें भी लिखी हैं जिनको आप अमेजन के माध्यम से मंगवा सकते हैं इनसे आप लोग इनकी वेबसाइट के माध्यम से जुड़ सकते हैं अंजलि पॉल इस एनजीओ की फाउंडर हैं और यह पंजाब में स्थित है हमारे साथी ने इनसे बात भी की है चलिए देखिए क्या क्या बातें हुई नमस्कार दोस्तों हमारी खबर टीवी की टीम पहुँच चुकी है खजुराहो में और हमारे साथ में मैम है जो कि पंजाब में इनों का जन्म हुआ है और इंग्लैंड में ये ग्रो अप हुई हैं वहाँ पे इनों इन्होंने अपना शिक्षा दीक्षा जो भी किया है और ये वर्तमान में एक एनजीओ चलाती हैं तो चलिए हम इनसे मैम से इनका नाम जानते हैं और एनजीओ के बारे में जानते हैं इनके क्वालिफिकेशन के बारे में जानते हैं पूछते हैं हाई मैम आवर यू वेरी वेल थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच फॉर डूइंग दिस माई नेम इज अंजलि अंजलि पॉल राइट Okay so uh, Miss Paul uh, could you tell me uh, in England where are you uh, living right now I grew up in Epsom in Surrey right. which is uh, about half an hour from London okay. as I'm sure many of your viewers will know and people just want to know about your qualification and what exactly about, uh, you are doing in your NGO so can you explain me uh, as well as your uh, qualification and NGO Well I um I have a degree in English literature and a postgraduate diploma in filmmaking. I have two yoga teacher training certificates and I am qualified to teach uh, grown-up people. But I don't know if these are qualifications. I'm actually a writer. I write books and um, you can see those on Amazon. They're, they're very, um, they're very uh, well-known all over the world. So I'm not sure if these qualify me. I think my main qualification is that I just wanted to help people, especially poor people and poor children. Yeah. As you said, you just want to help the people and the children. And you told me about you have the books which we can find on Amazon. So could you tell me uh, something, the name of the book, uh, which we can find and which is something related or connected with us? Uh, my mean to say connected with us is uh, like uh, that is explaining about the India something. So can you tell me the name? I have written uh, eight books, so I'm not sure which one to tell you first. I've, my most recent book is called The Advanced Guide to the Chakras and uh, I'm sure that um, everyone in India will be interested in that. After all, people are interested in the chakras and spirituality. And part of that is that, you know, as, as someone who is interested in spirituality, part of it is that it makes you want to help your fellow human beings. Yes. So, uh, Miss, as you told me, uh, people should be the human being, right? And we just want to know uh, about the NGO. Since when you have started your NGO? Sure. Uh, it started in uh, November 2021, and um, it's been well. It's been. It'll be two years now uh, in November this year. Uh, we have our first project is in Piantal village, which is quite near here. And um, there we provide free tuition and free food for um, underprivileged children, PPL children. All right. So how many people right now working with you in your NGO? So far our team is four people and we have 33 children. 33 children uh, with the four people they are managing. So what exactly your position is? <laughs> well, I, I'm a founder, I guess. And, I mean, you can call me a um, senior if you want to. But, you know, it's, it's just... Uh, 
I don't know what my possession is. Everything, really. And what exactly you have seen the difference between the India and as you have uh, gone there in England. So what is the difference in the culture and how you will be looking at this? You know, I think people are the same all over the world. There is not really much difference in human beings. They, we all have the same needs and desires. All parents want their children to do well and, and go far in life, everywhere you go. And, and one of the reasons that I wanted to help the children here was because I was here. I've been, I've been living here for five years in India, and so I thought I would like to do something. There is a lot to be done in England as well, that is the truth. Um, but so far, we are here and we are doing what we can. And if uh, people who are watching our video, what message you want to uh, tell them and what exactly, uh, how they can connect if anyone wants to connect with your NGO and they want to support you, then how they can connect and support you? Well, we have a website and on that website there are um, channels for you to get in touch with me and with the other director. So if that's what you would like to do, please do that. Um, we, uh, I guess that's that's the main way for people to connect with us through our website. Sure, and we'll take the website. So, friends, we will take the website link and the website link in our video. सबमिट करेंगे वेबसाइट का लिंक आपको तो आप उसके माध्यम से यदि कोई जुड़ना चाहता है कनेक्ट होना चाहता है एनजीओ को किसी प्रकार की हेल्प करना चाहता है तो आप उस लिंक के माध्यम से इनसे कनेक्ट कर सकती हैं एंड मैम वी जस्ट वांट टू नो इफ यू हैव एनी मैसेज व्हाट मैसेज डू यू वांट टू शेयर विद आवर एवरी पीपल हु आर लिविंग इन इंडिया आई जस्ट वांट टू थैंक एवरीबॉडी इन इंडिया एक्चुअली बिकॉज़ व्हेन एवर सिंस आई केम हियर पीपल हैव बीन सो काइंड रियली एंड सो हेल्पफुल and i just wanted to give something back all right thank you so much to ma'am ne bataya ki bhi logon ka dhanyawad karna chahti hain aur inhone apni website ka bhi address hamare sath mein share karenge to aap uske madhyam se inse connect ho sakte hain for the future we hope to do many more projects like this in the villages and also in the future we would like to go and do projects like this for street children in in cities like delhi um because my real dream is to help children who live on the streets and who have nothing i would like to um give them a way of making their lives um better thank you and this is there anything uh, how do you uh, get the money to run your ngo uh, can you tell us so far uh, i have been funding it myself um and um we have been doing uh, honest and transparent work so we have been doing like the the usual thing of having our annual reports and um showing them to people after 3 years um well it's been it will be 2 years for our foundation in november next year in november after that we will be eligible for government funding uh, and we will be looking for funding from the indian government as well to do our, our work so i hope i hope we get that thank you thank you